Welcome everybody to my Walking Dead review. <coughs> this is an exclusive interview of my thoughts on the first episode of Walking Dead. Now, since it's been back this previous past Sunday, <coughs> uh, there's been a lot of talk. I've had a lot of conversations with people on the Walking Dead virus fan page. Uh, I've been in fights with several people and made a friend. <coughs> uh, this kind woman stuck up for me. She's now my friend on Facebook. She sent me a friend request. What's up, man? I won't say her name out of respect, just in case. She stuck up for me when this other woman, even though she doesn't deserve my respect, I won't say her name. But all I said was that, you know, they were talking about couples. There was a specific photo in, in, in <coughs> one of the fans' posted a question about couples and all I said was Daryl and Beth I thought would have made a potentially good couple would have key words made a good couple this woman goes off lets me have it god dude I mean I swear to god like if she was in front of my face she probably would have slapped me silly <laughs> I mean god she was so immature She's like, Beth's dead, get over it, yada, yada, yada. And just totally let me have it, dude. Like, she got all worked up over it. Like, she must be a major Beth hater. Like, who in the hell would hate Beth? A, Beth was smoking hot. And B, she was a good, kind-hearted girl part of the fucking show. <clears throat> good part of the show. Her and Daryl were hitting it off, man. Okay? I'm upset about her death. Maybe just because this woman don't like her doesn't mean she has to trash talk me and everybody who dares uh, likes Beth. So this other woman kind of went to bat for me, said, you know, made a comment to her, stuck up for me. So I told her thanks, you know, then she sent me a friend request. Now we're friends on Facebook. You're awesome. Thanks for the sticking up. So anyway, <clears throat> about the show. I agree with a lot of people. Oh, I thought that there should have been more action. You figure, oh, you got a bunch of fans that are waiting for this show to come back on, anticipating a blockbuster nail by, and then they show previews for when it comes back on, and the words are saying action packed, nail biting. So we're sitting here foaming at the mouth thinking, oh man. <laughs> Nail-biting action pack. This motherfucker going to be tight. And we get a show, an episode with most store, mostly storyline. <laughs> what the? F oh, really? <laughs> I mean, you know, it was mostly storyline. So, you know, Tyrese got bit. I'm pissed about that. He saved Judith's life. Rick's daughter wouldn't be alive without him. And he's been cared for while they've been searching for Rick. The group got split up after the prison riot, which I'm about to show you a clip of in a second here. As an exclusive gift, I have access to every season, all the episodes. Not divulging my secret, <coughs> but I'm going to show you. A part of the prison riot because I'm gonna divulge my most uh, favorite moment in Walking Dead history. The most badass soldier motherfucker type of shit in this fucking show. And it involves Daryl Dixon, dude. Daryl and Rick are my two favorite characters, dude. Daryl's the shit, dude. I don't know anybody that might have thought of what he thought of. Maybe Rick. I'm not sure, but dude, what he did was some brave ass shit, and I'm going to get to that. But Tyrese was bit. It's a shame. People on the fan page were saying, good, he's dead. He was too nice for the world. You know, who cares? Uh, you know what? Bite my ass, people. I care. I like Tyrese, dude. What, what? Because he's black? What's up? Because he's black? Or what's the reason? There were so many people hating on him. And then this one person's like, oh, you know, all the black people get killed. 
Are you kidding me? Only two black people got killed. Bit. As far as bit. Only a few. All the white people got killed. What are you talking about? And people were liking that comment I made left and right. How, are you, Why do people have to bring racism up in the show? A lot more. The white people are the most that got killed in this show. And this person has the audacity to bring up that Tyrese got killed because he's black. <laughs> Come on now. But right now, I'm going to show you 8-Ball's most favorite badass moment of all time on Walking Dead. Let's go to the bean footage, peeps. And we'll get back to your thoughts and comments. Say what, say what? Let's re-roll that again. That, my God, dude, look at that. My hairs are standing up, bro. That, that scene is my favorite scene of all time, dude. And then that one where Daryl's fighting off those zombies looking for Sophia and his brother screwing with them, dude. Calling them a pansy and stuff. Dude. So I'm kind of hoping that Walking Dead picks up to the pace to where it was at the end of the prison riot, dude. That was raw. Daryl Dixon's a badass, dude. So, you know, I'm looking forward to tomorrow night, man. With this, this I guess this crazy, dangerous-ass group is out there that makes Terminus look like a church school choir. We're going to find out, peeps. Pound and like that subscribe button like it owes you money. And I'll see you next review. Peace out.